What? What is your problem? What are you laughing at? All right, what's the closest point? Is it safe to just first leave the Dorama there? Mm. Laughing. Secondly, the first person I encounter in this thing is Takumi, who I guess he kind of likes me, but for most of the series, he's kind of a Sundar, so he just is rude. <laughs> so I'm just like, oh god, this is gonna be. Alright, hang on a second. I didn't hear that. Sorry. Oh, that's because I turned it down. <laughs> View comments. Is it safe to just leave the. Eh, yeah. I think it's safe. Okay. So let's see here. Which way do I need to go? I need to go north. Eh. Eh. Wait. Is that a person? The alias you said this command to be of it does not exist. Eh. I don't know if I can drown in this. Or drown, drown, drowned. Words. Oh, what's this? Oh, 308. Mm -hmm. Look like a fat turtle. Okay, so I'm not gonna drown. But I'm really slow. I agree, Nightbit. Well said. What is this? Oh, jeez. Giant mosquitoes. I wish I could do this with mosquitoes in real life. Just fry them with lasers. What can I do with this? Jeez, Ugh. phone is going off like crazy. What the hell? Uh, extend satellites. Please stand back. Oh, okay. So it's just raising them. I thought, like, it was going to do something else. I never understood the whole slow-mo thing with Fallout. Does it not take away the difficulty of aiming? Um... That seems less fun. I, I would say yes and no. In Fallout 3, it was pain, a, a pain... Because it would just lock onto whatever was the easiest to hit. And you could never really get a good headshot. Because, like, uh, shooting third person or first person just was terrible. This one, though, feels more like an FPS. And I, <laughs> I like using the bats whenever there's... I don't know, it's like... Oh, how do you describe it? Eh. What is this? Oh, police protectron. Is this the bunker? Ugh. Oh, okay, it's a terminal. I'm gonna take the circuit boards. A psycho and carrot. Ugh.
Where's... Where's the bunker? This must be it. Is there a random car out here? There we go. Recon Bunker Theta. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna die in here a lot. Password. Open door. Safe. Safety come. Freeze. One more step and I'll, I'll blow your What the fuck, off. man? Who are you? Who sent you? How did you get in here? Uh Brotherhood. Too far away. They wouldn't send you, would they? Let's uh, let's say I believe you. How did you find me? <sighs> distress signals. I followed the distress beacons left by your team. Their hollow tapes led me here. The others. What? Uh, what happened to them? <sighs> you can give them the hollow tags. I recovered their tags. You. You... you did? Thank you. This... this really means a lot to me. I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but... But I'd hoped you'd been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, mm. odds and ends. If you see anything you want, take it, take it. How about you rejoin the Brotherhood? The Brotherhood needs you, Paladin. It's time you reported in. I, I, I can't. It's, it's been too long. I, I wouldn't be of any use. No one knows the Commonwealth better than you. We need your help. No, there's no going back. Not for me. Not anymore. Are you sure you won't reconsider? We need you, Paladin. No, there's no go. Try to do some recon, explore mm. a little, but um, come on. so I've been hiding so long. Uh -huh. Three years. Farewell, Brandis. Goodbye, and uh, and thanks. I, I gotta try to talk to the dude again. Let's see here. Aid. What? Do I need alcohol to like? Fats accuracy. Oh, jeez. Brandis. Look, just uh, just take what you need and go. You really are one of the good guys. <laughs> yeah, as I take the guy's power source. Ooh, a tuned sniper rifle. I need ammo, jeez. Dirty ashtray. Take his hairbrush. What's in here? Eh. I don't think we were done. Paladin Brandis. Take whatever you need, just leave me be. Alright. Got oil all over the floor. Ooh, duct tape. Yes. General? Thanks, Preston. I already know you think so. I know, but I don't know if you really get it. How unusual you are. Why? Because I'm met, walking around? I think you know I've really come to respect you, both as a leader and as a friend. Most people are just out for themselves, one way or another. 
even the good ones. But you're different. Uh. You really care about other people. I hope you're not flirt with me, Preston. Or even say it. I've seen you risk your life more than once to help people just because it was the right thing to do. I just wanted you to know that, well, that it matters. That you're making a difference. Okay. Flirt? <laughs> no. I don't want to flirt. You just described yourself, Preston. Quite the mutual admiration society we've got going here, huh? <laughs> no, but I hear you. And thanks. Let's just agree to. All right, enough chit chat. Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, I guess I didn't need that armor, so let's head back home. I guess I can drop my armor off. Since I can drop my armor off now, I guess I can get back to doing whatever other stuff I need to do. Missile launcher. What can I do with this thing? Triple barrel. Quad barrel. Oh, that looks like fun. Targeting computer. Why would I need a bayonet? Nocturnal switchblade. do anything with this it's mm. uh, oh. standard barrel and this thing is a freaking Tommy gun. Oh, and this one doesn't come with a, uh, a bayonet on the end of it. So, tuned sniper rifle. So, what does this one do? Modify this. Let me do with it. I could put a bayonet on the end of that too. <laughs> Ooh, that would look cool. Superior range and sighted accuracy, better recoil, reduced hip fire accuracy. Yeah, we'll exit the station. Should probably drop some stuff off. Store all the junk. Salt rifle. Where's the other one? Short salt rifle. So that's 30. It's 30. Okay, we'll go with a regular assault rifle. <laughs> 